It's been a state of lockdowns, restrictions, and work-from-home orders. For many, the COVID pandemic has made it feel like the walls were closing in and redefining what home really means. For immigrants, the process has at times been doubly difficult. Confinement to one's own physical dwelling, coupled with banishment, from the more familiar spiritual sense of home abroad. A new multidisciplinary art exhibit in Manhattan called Floating Walls calls together the works of seven Israeli artists living in New York City. The exhibition focuses on their personal relationship to migration and reconstituting one's definition of and relationship to home, reflecting on how the COVID-19 pandemic has impacted one's sense of place. I saw a lot of people relocating, moving, renovating, changing. So when this came along, I thought a lot about me, me too. I, we also changed our um, apartment and we thought a lot about walls. Gal Cohen is a visual artist living and working in Harlem. Her paintings offer alternative narratives to demolished historical houses from her hometown of Hedera. The whole concept of house or home is being rethought and re-established um, in our lives, um, but also as, as an immigrant, as a person who left home, who left house overseas, um, I, I feel that the whole emotional baggage that we carry goes down to the house or the home. Cohen is displaying a painting interpreting a house nearby her parents' home in Hedera, formerly owned by a man, Zachariah. Cohen described him as kind. He passed away a few years ago, childless, and the land was subsequently sold and the house flattened. The house no longer exists there. Next time I'm going to visit home after more than two years, I haven't been home because of the pandemic. I will not see one of the most significant um, structures that I was surrounded by as a kid throughout my whole life. So that's basically the rendering of, of his house. These are very, very sentimental and physical landmarks in my childhood landscape and in my own life. I don't know why, but I feel like a lot of Israelis are, uh, are, are exploring uh, architectural structures as symbols for home and as symbols for their identity. Floating Walls is on display at the Marlene Mayerson JCC in Manhattan through the end of February. Admission is free of charge and the exhibition is open to the public.